I'm Sean Hammond with PremierGuitar.com. We're at Music Messa 2013 in Frankfurt, Germany. We're at the Gamble Guitars booth and we're talking to Sasha, who builds these cool guitars we see right here. Stone's playing for us. We'll, we'll hear more from him in a second. Sasha, tell us about your company and the guitar that we're looking at. Yeah, hi. Um, yeah, my name is Sasha from, from uh, Gamble Guitars. Um, we are a new company in Germany. Um, we come from uh, the near from um, Colonia. And um, yeah, we uh, bought since two years guitars, and um, yeah, that is um, our our Rockfire. That is the Rockfire model. Um, it's, yeah, it's a Les Paul style. We have two humbuckers and um, mahogany neck, mahogany um, body. Yeah, we have a maple top um, and yeah, ebony fretboard. Um, that is yeah, classic Les Paul style. Um, yeah, we need yeah. What kind of pickups do you have in there? Um, we have fossil pickups um, or amber pickups. That is, yeah. Poisel or amber, yeah. those are popular yeah, right. choices over yeah, here yeah, in Europe. Right. right. Um, yeah, the, the pickups have a great sound and um, you can split it. Um, you have much, uh, yeah, much sounds. Okay, Sasha, so standard master volume, master tone, and through a pickup selector, or do you have like coil tap um, switching yeah. or anything? Yeah, we have coil tap. You can uh, split the, the, the calls, yeah, that is right. For both pickups? Yeah, right. Um, yeah, that is it. You have, uh, you have a bridge position, you can call it. You have a middle position, you can call it. And you have the yeah, neck position, you can call it. And yeah, that is it. OK. Stone, let's hear that thing. Thank you, Stone. Now, we're hearing this through an amp, a company called Cast Amplification, and we're going to grab Thomas from Cast and talk to him. So thank you, Sasha. Yeah. Before we go, where can people go online to find out more about your guitars? Um, yeah, um, www.gambleguitars.com is our internet site, or about Facebook. Yeah. Cool. Gambleguitars.com. Thomas, you're with Cast Amplification. Are you guys also based here in Germany? Yes, we are from Ratingen, which is close to Düsseldorf in the wine area. So, yeah, we're German, German made. <laughs> cool. Thomas, before we hear a little bit more from your amp, um, why don't you tell us a little bit about the design, what sort of circuitry, what you were going for? Okay. So, the amp is, is made based on the classic design everybody recognizes and knows. But a lot of players would like to have special options or special things they would like to have in the amp which you can't get out of the box from other manufacturers. So these amps will basically are designed on the classical look but will be made and manufactured by us on a special order from the customers. These, these amps we see here uh, are based on the classical plexi circuitry like but a it's super lead like a super lead but it has more gain and more flexibility to add its switches to the design and it was especially made for these mid mid range sound everybody likes and the the, the clearness in, in the tone in the distortion so is it 50 watt or 100 watt well this model is a 50 watt model mm -hmm. uh, it is a classical design also in the power amp so with the el34s and the uh, 12 AX7 in the preamp, but it has four preamps to have an extra push. Four 12 AX7s. Yes, exactly. Now, in a standard Super Lead, you would have four inputs there, but you have two toggles in their place. Tell us about those. Yeah, the two inputs basically are the model in the model in the now in the model world. You only need two. These are a little bit different in gain structure. 
So if you have a different kind of guitar which need more gain, you have one input. If you have a powerful output, humbucker stuff, you can put it into the other input. So you are flexible in, in, the, in the option here. And what do those switches next to the inputs do? Yeah. We added these switches because a lot of our customers said, yeah, I have several guitars and I need kind of a flexibility in this classical design because it's a, it's a one-channel amp, you have the, uh, your, all your knobs, but we, I need an easy switch for more gain or for, for more high treble, so we added this to the design. Okay, so one of them is sort of a treble boost or presence? Exactly, it's more a, a presence boost and the other one is a gain boost Does with a more mid-range feeling. Now, when you say it's a gain boost, is that engaging that fourth 12AX7? No, it's, it's in the circuitry. It will stay with the existing uh, uh, cas cascaded design, but it will add more, more gain into that. Okay. And are these on circuit? Is the circuit on circuit boards? Is it hand wired or? It's completely hand wired on tablet boards, so in the old style. Uh, of course, with modern material, which is for quality and long lasting stuff. And it's very robust, so everything is made for really on the road. You can, you know, every day, new job, and it will work. Okay, let's hear it. Let's hear a few different, a variety of sounds from clean to, to as dirty as it will go. What are we going to start off with? We start with the uh, less gain mode. So uh, Deepma will play a little bit, and then we will switch a different style on. <laughs> So in the middle of that uh, stone flipped the top toggles, that's the one for higher gain? Yeah, it's higher gain and it adds a little bit of more mid-range to the sound, so we have a more focus on the mids. Okay, and so in the bottom toggle, he's got it in the left position, which is less treble? Yes, exactly. It's less treble and you, you will hear it. If yeah, let, let's hear that and then switch it to the higher treble. Cool. Thanks, Stone. Thomas, where can people go online to find out more about your amps? Of course, on our website, which is www.castamplification.com. Awesome. Thanks, man. Thanks, Stone. Thanks. I'm Sean Hammond with PremierGuitar.com. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you don't miss any of our new Music Mesa videos.